it was. And yet I loved my spinning always. I sat and spun and listened. As they told the tales, my father spoke of Eric the Red, who had gone out of Iceland because of some killings and had found in a new colony in Greenland. I sat and wound the yarn and listened to the tale of Bjarni, Herjof's son, who went nine days to the west of Greenland and found fair lands there. That thread of that tale reached all the way back to Norway, where Bjarni had served the Earl, and came back to us with our neighbor, Torgir, whose son was a fine trader just returned from Norway. Hmm. Einar, Torgir's son, saw me at the door of the house and said to Orm that I was the woman he had in his mind. Orm said that he would propose for Einar to my father, but that I would be particular in my choice as well as he. I sat at my spinning and I wondered at my choice. Oh, I would like to be a sailor's wife. But my dreams lay to the west, not to Norway but to those strange lands that Bjarni had seen. And there I dreamed as my spindle sang its song. 